Hello, Indigo, Chapters, and Coals. I'm Jeffrey Deaver, author of the new James Bond novel, Carte Blanche. Thank you for all your support. I enjoyed very much writing this book, and I know you're going to enjoy it. My relationship with Ian Fleming goes back some time. I was eight years old when I read my first James Bond novel, which may sound like a, being a bit young, but in fact, Ian Fleming told a, a great adventure story that, that boys of any age can really, can really get into. And I, I do remember when I was about 11 or so, enjoying the books so much that I wanted to try my hand at writing an adventure story. And I, I did. It was, guess what, about a British agent. I remember I had great fun writing it, and I probably decided at that point that I wanted to become a thriller novelist. And I still look back at the, the early notes I took from the Bond books to remind myself, this is what writing is all about. Well, I was absolutely delighted to be asked to write the continuation Bond novel. But I always ask myself, what is going to excite the reader? What is going to make them turn pages and get their palms sweaty to find out what's going to happen next? And the Fleming estate said the same thing. They did not want a character-driven study of James Bond. They wanted a typical Jeffrey Deaver novel. It takes place over a short period of time. It has lots of internal surprises in it. I have multiple plots running throughout the books and each one of them has to be resolved in a way that is gonna surprise the reader. But they wanted their character, the James Bond that we know and love, in my kind of story. But we did have a few other things to talk about and coincidentally, we both felt the same way about this. The book had to be set in the present day. Bond, for instance, as the original Bond, is a veteran of the, uh, the British military, but he is a veteran now, not of the World War II, of course, but of Afghanistan. He's roughly 30 years old. Uh, he still lives in London. He uh, travels around the world as the original Bond did, but he um, goes through security like everybody else. It's the, uh, a, a present day version of a traditional James Bond tale. Here comes James Bond in the year 2011.